Here, this is a gigantic moth. Here it is outside, and it's like, I don't know actually what type this is. Okay, here we go. Whoa! Okay. Living free and in the wild. Hey there guys, so welcome to today's video. Um, this video is a little bit unplanned and I didn't really see it coming. Um, it just all of a sudden came to me when my sisters found something. And I'll show you that in just a second. Um, so basically what they found was this right here. This is a gigantic moth. And I just thought it looked super cool and I wanted to record it. Uh, just like I did the snake skin video. So we're going to take this outside where there's a little bit better lighting so you can see this better. Okay, here we are. I guess we'll just take it over here and have a good look at it. Uh. So, yep, here it is outside. And it's like, I don't know actually what type this is, but it is gigantic. Look at it. I'll also release it in the end of the video. I'm not keeping this or anything, and they're not keeping it either because, you know, it's kind of cruel to do that. Um, so, yeah, so here it is. It has this gigantic, like, design on the wings. I'm not sure what that is. But I think it's one of those moths that, you know, use that for, to make themselves look bigger, you know, when they attach to trees that looks like eyes or something. I think I learned that from Wildcats or something like that. Anyway, I guess we'll get down right here and kind of just show what this looks like. Okay, so here it is. We have this closer up, and it actually wants out. I will let it out. Um, so let me unscrew the lid a little bit, make sure it has some air, just a little bit, get some air back in there. Okay. Because there's no air holes in there, but we're not actually going to keep it for long enough for it to suffocate most likely. So just let some air in there and then close it back. Um, there's a look at the bottom of it. There's a look at some, at the wings a little bit more up close. So yeah, super cool. Um, not a very long video, but definitely an interesting video, at least for me to record because I've never actually captured one of these before. I didn't capture it, my sisters did, um, Grace and Ellie, so you can go to their channel if you want to. There'll be a link in the description for that. Um, anyway, so let's release this thing and see what that looks like. Okay, so here we go. I've got it and it still really wants out. We're gonna go ahead and get a little bit close to the ground and we're going to set the camera up and let it free. Okay, here we go. Whoa! Okay. It's flying away, if you can see that. Let's try to follow it and see where it goes. If we can even find it. It looks like it went in these trees over here or something. Whew. That flew off fast. Flew like a bird or something. So yeah, it's just way up there. It's completely gone. Um, so I have no idea where it went. Okay, so that's pretty much the end of the video, guys. That's just what I wanted to do. I wanted to show you something amazing that my sisters found. Of course, again, you can go to their channel if you want to. They do different things. They have, don't have that many videos yet, but they will hopefully in the future. I edit their videos for them. I also edit every other channel that we own right now videos because I just really enjoy editing. And anyway, so um, if you're wondering what, like, this wasn't actually a planned video, I said that in the beginning of the video, that's because this was going to be the original video, I was going to take you around our four-wheeler and kind of show you that and also drive it a little bit, but that kind of got ruined when I remembered that, the, oh, when I kind of figured it out again, I kind of forgot that the battery was dead, so I wasn't able to do that video, which is a little bit, um, sad, but all of a sudden I just found this and it, super exciting so I decided to record it you know not only for you guys enjoyment but if I want to look back on it in the future and be like wow that was a really gigantic um, moth which it was then I can definitely do that so thanks so much for watching us and I'll see you next time